a bit elaboration on the shoe sizes. Basically, you have to know, first of all, there is one is UK size. UK size, there is one Euro size, there is one US size. And then we have the inches and the centimeter. Starting from UK size, if someone is five and a half, then that would be 39 in Euro size. And the US size will be six. Someone is six in UK size, that would be 39 again, or Euro size. And US size would be six and a half. Someone is six and a half in UK size. That will be 40 in the Euro size and 7 in the US size. That will be 9.75 centimeters, inches, sorry, 9.75 inches and 24.8 centimeters. Someone is seven sized shoe that will be forty to forty one in euro size and seven point five US size that is nine point seven five inches or 24.8 centimeters then someone is seven and a half size that is 41 euro size and eight US size that is 9.9375 inches or 25.4 centimeters Someone is eight UK size, like myself. So that is 41 to 42 Euro size. Or US size would be 8.5 US size. Like 10.125 inches. Or 25.7 so for my size I'm 8 in UK and the euro size will be 41 to 42 and the US size for that is eight and a half but yet again if I go seven and a half of UK and 41 euro size, 41 euro size, and he's gonna give me eight of US size. And if I go for eight and a half of UK size, so that's gonna be 42 euro size, and nine US size so I could be wearing nine shoes but that is US nine eight and a half UK eight and a half UK and 42 euro size or I could be wearing you know eight US size forty one 
euro size and seven and a half UK size. Not seven and a half UK size, sorry. I could be wearing forty one to forty two euro size and that is eight in UK and eight and a half in US. So that really gives a little bit of understanding how the systems of different sizes shoe sizes hope this under this um, explains the other issues about shoe sizes